Hi and welcome to this video where we're going to be looking at a quick update on our Emperor Moth Caterpillars. This is Mila, say hello. Okay, and uh, we're going to show you their growth over the last few days. And how big are they now, Mila? Really big. Really big, aren't they? What are they going to do soon? They're going to they start to go into their cocoons. Cocoons, that's right. Okay, I'm going to uh, show you a few clips we recorded over the last um, week where we went on holiday, didn't we? Where did we go? To Wales. Yeah, we went to Wales. So obviously the caterpillars had to come with us, didn't they? So, um, have a look at this uh, footage and you'll see them uh, eating lots of privet and uh, getting very big. And uh, also hit subscribe if you want to see uh, the next part of this video as the uh, caterpillars start to develop, hopefully from their cocoons. As you can see with the uh, caterpillars, we've been feeding them on privet. This is something we've had to do pretty much every day. Every day they've been cleaned out, given fresh paper towels, fresh privet, and they just continue to eat and eat and eat uh, and increase in size quite quickly. We actually had to go on holiday to Wales and um, we took the caterpillars with us. So um, whilst we were there, we were obviously changing them, bedding and uh, food every day and then uh, to the point where we've just got back and they're pretty much I think full size although there's been one or two that have remained a little behind and a bit smaller not sure if they're going to continue to grow or whether they maybe won't survive as you can see they, they do poo quite a lot uh, which is one reason they have to be changed daily Uh, this one that we're looking at here is one of our favourites. It's all black with the uh, the little pink spikes. Another thing we noticed was that once they'd run out of food, obviously they continued to be quite active, actively looking for food, but also started attacking, nibbling at each other. Not sure if they thought they, they could eat each other, but as soon as more food was put in, this was quickly uh, resolved and they uh, no longer paid attention to each other. We're just going to have a little close-up of uh, some of the caterpillars. You can see the speed at which they eat, just stripping that leaf down, starting from the top and working his way down. It really is uh, quite impressive how quick they can get through this kind of uh, much amount of leaves. Privet.
again uh, a little bit more close up there of him uh, eating like the hungry caterpillar This is some of the most recent footage I've got from the caterpillars of the past uh, few days. Pretty much at full size. As you'll soon see, uh, they're starting to uh, produce silk and starting to cocoon up or getting ready to cocoon. And there we can see the first one in its cocoon. Another one sort of made a half cocoon and it looked like it kind of broke a little bit and the caterpillars came out of that. Not sure what's going to happen with him at the moment, whether or not he's going to make a new cocoon. But we shall see. Thank you for watching and please hit subscribe if you want to see the next part of this video and see what happens with the caterpillars. And if they uh, all cocoon up and if they then emerge as fully grown emperor moths.